How to use copper cookware. Copper conducts heat better than aluminum, stainless steel, and cast iron and is the choice of many choosy chefs. You will need copper cookware, warm water, dishwashing soap, a dishcloth, and copper polish. Optional, ketchup. Step one. Before using your copper cookware, hand wash it with warm, soapy water. Scrub the inside with care to avoid scratching the coating. Dry immediately with a soft dishcloth. Clean especially well before using if you see greenish-blue spots inside the pan, which can indicate verdigris, a poisonous chemical reaction that occurs when copper is exposed to acetic acid. Step 2. When cooking sauces in copper, don't stir as often as you would when using other types of cookware. Copper heats more evenly than any other metal, so you won't have to worry about whether some parts of the pan are cooler than others. Step 3. When frying or sauteing, add the fat to the pan and cook on low for one minute before increasing the heat and adding other ingredients. Step 4. Use copper when making sugar syrups, preserves, caramel, and melting chocolate. Copper's heat conductivity and quick reaction to temperature changes offers a precise control over the different stages of candy preparation. Step 5. Whatever you cook, allow the cookware to cool completely before washing or it may warp. Remember to dry your cookware immediately with a soft cloth. Step 6. As your cookware begins to lose its luster, develops water spots, or turns pinkish, purple, or orange, polish it with anti-tarnish copper polish. Ketchup also removes copper tarnish, though it doesn't restore shine. Apply a thin layer to the outside of cookware and allow it to stand for 5 minutes before rinsing. Step 7. Store your cookware in a dry place at room temperature. Keep it away from heat and humidity, which can make it tarnish faster. Did you know? Cooking utensils have been made of copper for more than 3,000 years.